So this video is about what I got to play and do um, at Hot Lead. So I played Chain of Command for the first time, and it was a desert scenario, which I really like, because I really like the desert um, stuff in World War II. I just like the look of it. Uh, the Africa Corps, um, I just love the colors, and um, I was playing the Africa Corps against some Sikhs. There's my anti-tank gun set up in ambush, and this is from the um, down the way, the Sikh uh point of view. So they dropped smoke right on my anti-tank gun. Ugh. So I had to actually move it through the smoke and it took forever. Um, turns and turns later I finally got it ready, started shooting at the Matilda, and uh, yeah, no effect. Um, but I did manage to eke out a win with my forces um, coming around one flank, uh, taking out all these guys that were here. Just lots of machine gun fire. Finally um, just like buzzsawed them um, out of the game. Um, I did take a number of losses but in the end um, they did not use their, uh, little tank there, um, and their Matilda to good use, and I was able to exploit that and win the game. And this is their final stronghold, which I would have, um, encircled and destroyed if not for the game ending. This was lunch, um, Boomer's Gourmet Fries, a fantastic little place in Stratford, Ontario. I will definitely need to be going back, because look at all the different burgers they have. I got the French Poodle, which was a back bacon, brie, and Dijon, um, burger with goat cheese fries. After lunch, I came back and played um, another two Fat Lardies game, uh, Ducks Britannia Romum. Um, it was a six-player game. I played uh, one flank of the Romano Brits, which I really like. I really like the, the look of the Romano Brits. Um, Dark Age uh, games have a, such a really good look to them. The models are always so good. Um, they, they paint up so nicely and, you know, basic simple colors but like those shields especially for those Romano Brits I love those anyway a really cool little scenario the uh, Saxons had to come and either burn that watchtower or loot the church um, and we Romano Brits had to stop them sadly in the end they did burn down the watchtower uh, my flank fell hardcore I was doing really well in the beginning like really really well and I, I, I think splitting up my forces um, and then a lot of bad rolls um, just was the end of me so that was that great game though I'd like to play it some more, or Saga, or whatever. And here are just some shots of an upcoming game, maybe you've heard of it, Flint and Feather. These are some amazing, amazing models. Um, there was a demo game that I watched a little bit of, and it looks interesting. Um, I'd have to see some more of it, but the models look fantastic. Anyway, that's what I got to play. Thanks for watching. See ya.